Okay guys, in this video tutorial, we will learn that how we can set the limits of x-axis and y-axis within the plot in the MATLAB. For it, first of all, we need a matrix T and we will assign certain values like uh, 1 colon 0 0.1 colon 10 so the value starts from 1 and the maximum limit is 10 and point 1 is the step size between adjacent element so now we will take the sign is equal to sign of D then on all the values of D on each and every value of D sign function will be applied and after the application of sign function all the values will be stored inside this variable T when we will write t and press enter then we can see that we can have a lot of values <coughs> so we will write plot of t and here we got our plot but as you know that we don't have any sort of restriction on the value of y axis and x axis. The y is up to 1 and the x is up to 100. But if we write x is 0, 1, 0 and 200 and 0 and 5, so what it, it means that the lowest limit for x is 0 and highest is 200 the lowest limit for y is 0 and highest is 5 so when we will enter it and we will see then that now you can see that our limit for y axis is 5 and our limit for x axis is 200 here we chop the negative part so we can also write like uh, minus 5 to 5 so that because it is the lowest value of y axis so when we will enter it okay wait first we write plot of t and then we write minus 5 to 5 for minus 2 to 2 it's okay if, if we insert 2 still it is okay for us and here you can see that y starts from minus 2 and goes to 2 and x starts from 0 and goes to 200 so in this way we can set the limit on y axis and x axis values so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for watching